Can Dojo Swap be a game changer for Shinja holders? Well in this video I am going to explain everything in detail. Now those of you who don't know Dojo Swap is now functional, there is a possibility of few bugs, but those issues will be fixed once they integrate the new UI. Now before we proceed further and talk about how Dojo Swap could be a game changer, you guys should know what are the current issues with Shibnobi. So the first negative point about Shibnobi is the supply is way too much, and until last week Shinja had no auto burn mechanism, meaning devs had to manually burn tokens to reduce the supply. The second thing is the pre-sale wallet holders, every time there is a pump the pre-sale wallets are going to dump their tokens, that's the reason we are trading so low. Now these two are the main factors Shinja's price doesn't pump, now the market works on emotions, suppose if a pre-sale wallets dumps 200 ethereum worth of Shinja, then people will start panicking, and even they will sell their tokens. So this issue is creating lot of problem for Shibnobi holders. Every time there is a pump, the pre-sale wallets dumps the token, and the price keeps tanking. Now how can Dojo Swap help us to deal with this situation? Now those of you who don't know Cliff has enabled auto burn mechanism and auto buyback only for Dojo Swap. Now every buy and sell transactions that takes place on Dojo Swap, a certain percentage of it will be burned and bought back automatically. Meaning if you buy or sell Shinja via Dojo Swap, a certain percentage of Shinja will be burned automatically and also be bought back at the market price, which will reduce the circulating supply. Now Dojo Swap cannot help us deal with the pre-sale wallet holders, but it can help us in reducing this huge supply to a great extent. Now I am not saying once Dojo Swap launches, the hyper burn will start. For hyper burn and buybacks, Dojo Swap needs to be successful, it needs to drive more traffic. Now the only way Dojo Swap can be successful is if it launches exclusive and new tokens on Dojo Swap. Now an average user like me and you are not going to go and purchase tokens from Dojo Swap, which are already available on exchanges, but suppose a token which is not available on any exchanges or is launching exclusively on Dojo Swap, then we are obviously going to purchase them from Dojo Swap, and this is the only way Dojo Swap can be successful, and we might witness a hyper burn. For example, if a XYZ token which is not available on any exchanges and decides to launch exclusively on Dojo Swap, people are going to jump on Dojo Swap, and this way they are going to drive in more traffic. More traffic is equal to more transactions and more transaction will result into hyper burn and buybacks, which will reduce the supply and increase the price of this token as time passes by. Now with the auto burn they are also going to conduct normal burns. Right now when you buy and sell Shinja on exchanges or private wallets a certain percentage of fee is collected, which is used for burns. At the time of recording this video, Shinja has around 35 to 36 sextillion of circulating supply, we need to reduce the supply to around 1 sextillion, that should be our target by the end of this year, or by the first phase of next year. This will not only help us to increase the price, but also help us to eat 2 to 3 zeros smoothly. Now this goal can be achieved only with the help of auto burns, buyback and manual burns. This all depends on the success of Dojo Swap. So this is how Dojo Swap can be a game changer for Shinja investors. Regarding the pre-sale wallets, sadly we cannot do anything about it. There is an anti-bot mechanism, but I doubt if that is working. Now as you all know Dubai Expo is going on and the coming week we have a tier 1 exchange listing. So this week and upcoming week is going to be a decider for Shinja's future. I hope Cliff cracks many deals as possible in this Dubai Expo. Let's hope for the best. Thanks for watching. Also let me know in the comment section if you want me to do a math video on Shinja's price prediction until 2024. I grew up in a place where they told you what to chase, told you how to run the race, every move was on the page, but I didn't like their way, had to fight and misbehave, had to find a way to change, had to leave to find my way. Caught up in a daydream, I be in my mind up there almost daily It's how I pass time, no opinions safely It's how I understand what I want in this place, see